Alright guys, today we're going to be looking at the USNF uh, Olympia. So, this is a light, light frigate designed to be not the flagship of the United States National Fleet, but the, um, the command center base ship, you know what I'm talking about. Alright, so up here is the bridge, there's a, um, the bridge, the way to get, there's like an airlock, docking station, the main engine bay is back there, there's a there's cargo fighter bay in there, and there's a lot of turrets. Alright, so let's start, let's go in here, alright. So here's the main docking airlock thing. What's that? All right. Well, so back here is the auxiliary reactor. That's if that's a backup reactor in case these reactors were to go down, and they're connected downstairs into the main cargo hold. All right. Let's see. Um. So up here is a couple gyroscopes. And here's access to one of the turrets that's up on top. And the same thing is over on the other end of here. Alright, let's see. Go back down the stairway. Now, I think down here is... This is... Yeah, this is the main stairway. Alright. Over here is access to the, the fighter bay. It's got three fighters. You could probably fit a fourth one up up here, but it'd probably be pretty tricky. I'm not sure. Oh, and there's the auxiliary command deck fly the ship thing. Um, there's a window. Oh, and these are these access out to um. <coughs> excuse me. These access out to turrets on the outside. Yeah, there you go. That's the work. Um, let's go back out here, back down this hallway, or oh, this is the stairway, this is where we want to go. And let's what was down here. Sorry, I can't navigate my own ship. Oh, down here is the auxiliary reactor, and this was, oh, this is an extra storage. With, this is, um, this connects up to all the turrets on the front. To the, sorry about that. To the main, the main cannons. There's there's four of the two there, and two there, and those are just in case this ship needs to engage something, but it really shouldn't because it's designed to stay in the back and command all the the carriers and fighters, and all the stuff in a battle or whatever it'd be commanding. Um, here's extra storage. And this just goes down to the below here to access that. Um, I think this is yeah, I'll go reactor access. And it does that weird bug with the light, with the windows, and it reflects stuff. Um, and so we can go back up here, and we're gonna go back to the central stairwell. Alright. So this is going to be really sickening for somebody. If I do this fast, I'll try and go slow. These are just windows. You can see some of the main cargo hold in there. This is the ground floor access to the, the cargo holders, the ship fighter thingies. Yeah, sorry, I'm not good with words today. Um, here is, these all connect up to this, well these connect to that and that's some of the turrets, and this room here, yeah, um, a lot of gyroscopes, um, some engines, um, that's not connected to anything, that's, that's also, uh, it's alright though, um, these engines are just, some of these were, when I first tested the ship, there were no, there were literally two small go backwards engines. So I'm like, oh crap! And it, it almost like crashed into an asteroid. So I had to fix that. All right, so 
looking at a massive gyroscope room. Um, over here through the, the fighter bay. Cargo thing. Um, and then back here, if we come out here on the stairwell, is the cargo hold. And there's three big connectors hooked up to conveyors, and pipes, and whatnot, and those all go most places. Up here is there's a stairway and it goes to here, which goes into here, which has a refinery, assemblers, and some storage. Just because, just in case you need to, you need to make something on the ship because you really need to go off ship. Um, here's a medical bay. This just goes outside into some. Some players, the reactor, which is in blank space. Um, I think this does. The, this goes into the reactor. Yeah. All right. Okay. Let me go back. I'm not really closing any of these doors. Um, so that was the main assembly and final room. Do some light in there. Um, so let's go back. I'm assuming you want to see the bridge now. I think this goes down a little bit. Oh yeah, this just goes into some more blank space with some turrets. Um, yeah, that's just nothing. Or is it? No, it's just it's nothing. Alright, let's go back. Back up the stairway. Alright, there's the main reactors. Uh, these windows sometimes they work. There's the the fighter bay controller. Um, I think this, yeah, this is the extra the extra command thing. If the ship were to, if the main main bridge were to get shot down, you would go and pilot the ship from there. Let's so go back up here. Oh, here is the the door to the outside. Yeah, when I first made this ship, those were the only two. The only two engines going that way, so it was like impossible to stop. Yeah. And these these were kind of just so you could like you know get up and fight stuff. If people were trying to get on your ship. And these all these are the um these are the turrets. There's I think like one or two rocket turrets, and most of the other ones are um, these gathering turrets. And those are all connected up underneath to conveyors and to cargo crate things. Alright, so up we go. This is uh, the beacon that has some ship name on it. You must have nothing about the blinding. Yeah, there it is. Um, this is just storage. This is some gyroscopes. Yeah, the whole room goes back to there. And some gyroscopes. Alright, this is. I think this is just like a grabby generator. Up here is the bridge. Now there's a bunch of different seats that are not facing the right way. Um, but yeah. And so the captain would sit here and fry the ship. I think we can we can really try that now and see if it doesn't break. Alright. Let's get the stats up and see how fast oh it's okay. So let's see, let's just go in a straight line. I'm not gonna hit anything. Don't mind all that stuff up there, it's it's stuff that's messing around with. Alright, so we got fifteen It's gonna take a while. Alright, so you can tell. You can probably get going pretty fast. We're gonna do turning speed in a second. Hold on. Alright, so let's see. Turning. That's turning. Stopping turning. Turning. So if I just do one slow with my mouse, I don't have a very sensitive mouse. Uh, let's do barrels. Okay. I think that's, that, that, that's pretty good, I think. I don't have much to compare it to, but. Oh, there goes the moon. Okay. Oh, trippy. Okay. All right then. Oh, and here's the. Um, 
Nothing's making out nothing. Doesn't mean those guys. I tried shooting those when the ship was turning and it didn't really end well because the, the rockets hit the hit the, the main strut thing. I'm pointing at it, you guys can't see me pointing at it. Um down Oh hold on. Down there, the yellow thing, and the thing behind it that's not yellow, those are, I'm not sure, I'm not, I'm not good, I haven't tested them out yet, but they're supposed to be able to hook up to a con collector and a connector or whatever they are. I'm supposed to connect up to the, like a station or something so it could refuel, because those, those connect up to the main, main storage, main cargo, which is in the little bit that bumps out. Yeah, so... That was the United States Space Fleet Thing Olympia. Alright. There's the moon. There's Earth. And there's the ship. Thanks for watching.